And welcome back to another episode of Zelda. So I pulled a big dum dum move and I got all the way to the Yiga's hideout and it wouldn't let me in. Mainly because you had to go talk to the captain's guard, which I did not do, so it would just not let me in. And it, it, it was so awesome. I came back to the area right here where they killed me and it was nothing. I, all I did was simply walk backwards and destroyed them. They couldn't hit me just because I was continually walking backwards. It was nuts. And of course now, yes, I, I was big confused. I was wondering what the hell was going on because I went up, the door was shut. I was like, this is this has never happened to me before, I swear. Uh, so I went all the way around the base to the backside where you have the boss fight. It, too, was also closed. I was so confused, dude. So I decided I had to go back over here, did that, and I was like, ooh, tower. Might as well get the tower. So I climbed all the way up there because it, it was the one with the... It only had little resting points at the very top. It was an incredibly tall tower, so I had to climb all the mountains and do all the things to avoid moblins because they were all over the place. So we have to sneak around, be quiet. Because we don't want to mess around. We don't want to find out. Vicious cycle. I said cycle, I meant sickle. Yeah. Well, that didn't work out very well now, did it? I'll take that sickle. Fire arrows. That is what we need. So we'll just waste our regular arrows. Ooh. Ooh, I... Oh, I was about to say, dude. Uh, okay, so treasure chest. And then... Not, oh, no, no, there was one more! I don't think it really matters, though. Oh, so much for our duplex bow. Did somebody just say, mm? That's not very good. Okay, there we go. I'm I'm guessing somebody was in here hiding. I just heard a, somebody go, Mmm. I don't need a torch. Get away from me. You disgusting little rat with wings. And one giant eyeball? How, how does it eat? Like, what does it do? It, its body must consist of... Just eyeball. It doesn't even have a lower jaw, it just has two giant fangs, so I assume it just purely runs off the blood. Dude. I'm gonna have to look those up later. I wonder if there's any like more detail about them, because I, I could see them just using their oversized fangs just as like little feet to perch. I was gonna say perchers, but I was, I was like, what am I talking? It's feet. Little foots, talons. <sighs> More treasure. More treasure. At least they have some good stuff up in here. Ooh. An apple, of course. I mean, it's to be ex Actually, no, I'm, <laughs> I'm quite surprised to find an apple up in here. These dudes love bananas of the mighty banana so right on up ahead we should find what's her face i can never remember her name she's right there and we gotta be super sneaky super duper quiet like like that they're big dum-dums anyways they're not gonna notice I, I mean i could just lay some bananas down hey what are you doing in here this is the hideout of those Yiga thieves who stole the Thunderhelm. If they spot you, they'll call their friends for sure. There's no way you can take them all on. Oh. If only you had some way of distracting them, but I don't know how. You mean, like these bananas? Don't, don't worry. Don't worry, lady. We got it. And by the time we get out uh, and beat the boss, 
you'll have enough time to break free. Ooh. Alright, there should be one dude around here. Oh god. We'll just lay these uh, bananas. Where's the bananas? There they are. No, I... Okay, I guess I can hold. Place. Yep, he's doing his adorable little dance over there. He's excited. Okay, so we, now we just gotta be careful with this one. While he stashes the bananas away. I guess I could break that. Oh, God. Hold. There we go. You should be distracted by those bananas. Get excited. They're right there. Yeah, <laughs> he's excited. It's so adorable. Seeing them all excited just for a bundle of bananas. Or should I say a bushel? I don't know. Gotta be careful. Gotta be super sneaky up in here. This is... We're in the land of the banana lord at the moment. You think they would want to hide jewels and precious stone. They have a few of those. But no. The ultimate precious stone to them would be a banana stone. I just, I know there's a gym just laying around here. I can't remember where it is. Could be like right underneath me though. More bananas. Oh, it's right there. And look at all these bananas. Truly the apex of fruit. If you don't believe me, then why would they just be hiding all these bananas here? Give me the last banana, thank you. Oh, 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 hold on. I didn't see this. So we got some topaz, and uh, we want to go down here. It might make it a little harder on us, but it'd be really good money. Ooh. Look at all the gems. Okay, so we'll... I guess we could... Oh, God. Okay. Be super sneaky. Sorry, I had to focus real hard for a second. Okay. Now we're over here. We just need to get over there. That shouldn't be too much of an issue now, right? Oh, God. Okay, hold on. Banana time! Yes. Yes, see the bananas. Get excited for bananas. Oh, yes, there we go. Come on, Link. There we go. Okay, just in time, too, Jesus. Alright, I'm not sure if there's any more gems in here, but I think we should actually be A-OK -okay off of that, yo. And then we'll just drop some uh, bananas right here for this guy. Hold. Place. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, 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 Super good, huh? Oh, look at him. He's like, these are mine now. Okay, so we're good. We're good. Oh, we can replace all those arrows that I just wasted. Another duplex bow for the one I destroyed. Okay, so now for the chests. Wee yeah, come on. Uh, whoa, watch out. You gotta be careful with those. Those will definitely hurt you. 
So yeah, they're, they're gonna have a lot of topaz, I guess, hiding around as well, just for the fact that it's yellow. Like a banana. Mighty bananas. Should have guessed it. I wonder if anything would happen if we hit these. Nope. Right. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ooh. Damn it. Ooh. Nope. We got a lot of treasure just laying around here, but they had to deliberately do that because they probably thought we were too dumb to notice that this is a fake wall. It gives you a little ins like if it Ooh god. If they just had like one chest right there near, I guess I could be like, yeah, yeah. Oh, ooh, there's a hidden wall. That's pretty clever. They j I don't know why they would just bury their chest. Chest. They bury their chest. They're manly and I don't know. Ooh. Wrong way. Their uh, treasure chest. Other way. I'm trying to pull. This way. <laughs> All right, now for uh, a big goober time, which uh, everybody's all excited, I guess, that he's making an appearance, or somebody else, the Yiga, basically. But I would assume just like some form of this guy. I didn't, I didn't watch the trailer, so I'm not trying to spoil myself on everything. Like here and there, I'll watch stuff. <laughs> Hooray! Yes, me, I. Hello, hello. <laughs> Hmm. But yeah, basically this guy is in Age of Calamity. <laughs> Who the heck are you? And what are you doing in my napping spot? This is quite a large napping spot. I would imagine it looks cold. Mm -hmm. the, that thing on your hip. Is that... Could it be a Sheikah Slate? If it's a Sheikah Slate, that, then that means... Yeah, it's you. You're that Link guy I've been looking for. <laughs> what luck. My scouts are out in the field looking high and low. But you just wander into my hideout. Uh, uh, excuse me. I <laughs> haven't introduced myself yet. I am the leader of the Yiga Clan. The strong. The burly. The one and only... Master Koga! Now prepare yourself. Okay, uh, so we got this prepared, we're good. Oh god, hold on. It's been a little bit, so we, we just gotta hit him, right? Oh god. That was a close one. You could have really done some damage to me if you were any better. A boom! You might just want to focus on protecting yourself. Oh, we get the booty whap. Hey, boom. Oh, hey. Bro, you're about to get spanked again. <laughs> I tickled his foot that time. Like, if you look how little damage our sword does to him, though, he, he is quite strong. Whoop, whoop. It's just mainly doing these bits. There we go. <laughs> the spinning noise. I'm more curious, like, how is he floating there? I, I'm not sure. What is how? I know your game. I know what you're up to. Yes. Yeah, try to be all cool. It don't work. Boop. Ooh. Ah. Spank in the booty. Oh, dude, we hit him so hard. Link, what am I doing here? I don't know what I'm doing. Hold on. There we go. I'm whistling. Watch a giant horse just fall out of the sky on him. Uh, our giganto horse. Oh, maybe that was a little too... Oh, no, I've still got him. You've been very bad. Santa Claus is going to have to punish you right now. You're definitely not getting any mighty bananas this Christmas. Nothing but pain, in fact. Ooh. Told ya. Come on. 
Yeah. Do, 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 boom. Ba bam Well, well, well. How do you feel about yourself now? <sighs> who, who would have thought I'd be done in like this? And by this guy of all people. Do you think I'm just going to let this stand, do you? <clears throat> I almost lost my temper there. Ugh, what a pain. I can't go out like this. What do I do? What do I do? Yeah, I got it! <laughs> uh, he's laughing, so I guess I don't have to laugh for him. <laughs> I need to bust out my serious moves. A secret technique taught by my father's mother's father. It will destroy you. This is the end. Oh, you might want to watch out. You, you, if you've been having too much Taco Bell and you're focusing that hard. <laughs> uh, uh, maybe it's just a tad too big. Uh, are you still over there? Well, uh, no matter. Pretty soon you'll be gone. And not just from my line of sight. Only the leader of the Yiga clan can use this secret technique. And I didn't read the rest of that. It was like the Austin Powers. Like, the steamroller. Coward! I shall remember. No, oh, I shall be remembered. I thought he was going to say, I shall remember this. Um, but yeah, no, the whole Austin Powers bit where he's just standing there and the steamroller is going like two miles an hour towards him. The Yiga clan will track you to the ends of Hyrule! Even though he already technically fell all the way down there. He was just waiting for me to catch up. <laughs> that ain't no thing. Well, well, well. I don't, I don't know why the Thunder Helm would just be like right here out of all places. Like a hidden chest or something. It kind of reminds me of that bit from Twilight Princess where you knock off that, the, I forget his name, the giant booger. I always call him the giant booger. Um, because you knock him off the bridge in a duel. He falls off the bridge. You clearly see him fwom, and out of nowhere just a key flies up. Like, what? What? How does that work? Unless he was, he had the strength to throw that little key all the way back up to Link. I don't know. Oh, 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 what am I doing? We don't have to leave now. We already know uh, she's gone. She made it out safely, and I always forget to press the map. So I accidentally unlocked this region. I meant to unlock this region, but I wasn't paying attention. You know how I do. You know how I be doing. Travel. I can't believe we got out of there. We got out of there without any hitch. It was... Because usually, my last two runs on that, I always get spotted at least once. And then I run all the way out the cave. They stop following me, I run back into the cave. It doesn't, it, it don't really matter. It don't matter. We just gotta return, oh, hold on, we can't, we can't return dressed like this. Testing out our new heat-resistant armor. Which I, it doesn't doesn't make sense to me heat resistant as in because the sun is still shining on us we we should be red like a lobster right now and i don't even like lobster i don't like seafood really boop, boop. I wonder how many people are just watching me right now. Very confused. They're all at their shops in the market and stuff, and they're like, okay. Oh, oh! That, that reminded me, because sorry, I, I saw the little red icon pop up for, like, a side quest on her. Um, Because you can obtain the, the Thunder Helm. I forgot about that. Hello, you're waiting for us. I know it. I've been waiting for you. Oh, well, you needn't say a word. As the chief of the Gerudo, I can sense the power of the heirloom flowing from you. I know that you've succeeded. 
I am, as you have no doubt noticed, still but a child. Hmm. The people look on me with nothing but warmth in their eyes, but even this brings me some pain, I must admit. I've tried so hard to be a worthy to be worthy of their love, to be a worthy chief, and to prove myself what I, that I was worthy too. When my family heirloom was stolen, I felt as though a shadow had fallen over me. Yes, your arrival in the midst of all this must be the work of Lady Urbosa. Now, please give me the helm. This is probably going to be like one of the best parts of the game. Womp. <laughs> the thing's so freaking big on her little head. Uh, how do I look? You look like a giant electronic spider. And it's giving Link flashbacks. She's still waiting for an answer. She's like, how do I look? And Link's just like, uh... I wonder if we'll see these scenes played out in Age of Calamity, like any more context with these scenes. Ah, well you certainly got here fast. I should have expected as much from the princess's own appointed knight. She was out on a survey all day today, still as the sand now. So, spill it boy. Have the two of you been getting along all right? Trying. It's okay, I know. Your silence speaks volumes. She gets frustrated every time she looks up and sees you carrying that sword on your back. It makes her feel like a failure when it comes to her own destiny. Don't worry, it's not like you carry blame in any of this. It's unfortunate. She's put in more than enough time. Ever since she was a young girl, she's gone through rigorous daily routines to show her dedication. She once passed out in the freezing waters trying to access this sealing power. And she has nothing to show for it. That's the motivation driving her research. I'd be doing the same thing. She really is quite special. You be sure to protect her with your life. It's quite the honor. The night brings a chill. It's probably time we take her in. Hmm. Or... Boom! Urbusa! What was that? Did you feel that? Wait, what? How did you... What are you doing here? <laughs> what, what's so funny? That's, I, I think my issue with this, uh, at least like the iteration of Zelda, she was always like such a tryhard. It, it, it was almost as if, um, if I remember correctly, it, to me personally, it felt like she would resent Link due to the whole prophecy type thing because she didn't want Link to get hurt so anytime he he took his duty seriously like she would go do her thing he would magically appear because he's super fast and nimble like that she would she would just be like I don't need you I don't need your help and I'm just like okay <laughs> what's wrong uh, you're just staring anyway uh, what matters now is how... how is it? Do I look alright? You just asked that! Like, minutes ago, Link's just been, like, again, standing here like, oh, Remembering. That <laughs> uh, looks good. It's a tad big. Try to stay on the blunt side. Ah! <laughs> that, you don't say. The threat divine beast Vadna Boris poses has only grown since we began searching for the heirloom. I believe that Gerudo town itself may be in danger before too long. As chief and as Gerudo, 
I must find some way to stop that thing before it threatens my people. Will you help me? Of course! <laughs> uh, who would have thought that just before such a momentous battle, hearing a simple, confident pledge of support from you would be what puts me at ease. I'll head out now. Let's meet up at the lookout post south of town. Ugh. There's only one way to get close to Naboris, and that's with the help of a sand seal. The lookout post isn't too far from town, but you should take a sand seal there. You can get some practice in that way. I'll be there waiting for you with my favorite sand seal, Patricia. <laughs> Just... <laughs> oh, man. It's still... It really is a little big. It's just such like a massive mask. Like I, th it looks to be made of what gold. I think. May I mean, it could be bronze, copper. I don't know. It has that bronzy, goldish uh, hue about it. But uh, I wonder, like, what about it makes it? Uh... Can we climb, please? Resistant with the the thunder stuff. Even though we, we could literally just go out and get the thunder, not, not the thunder, uh, the rubber armor. But yeah, so next episode, we're going to be pulling up, chilling in style with a new sand seal. And stopping Naboris. Because that's just how we do, that's how we be. Wait, am I going the right way? No, yeah, yeah, no, I'm totally going the right way. Sand seals are right here. I'm so, okay. I was confused for a second. I was, I was like, I thought I was going the right way. But yeah, dude, we are finally stopping Naboris. And then after that, I'm going to be buying so many uh, bomb arrows. Yeah, that's it. And then we kill Ganon. That's, well, no, we don't technically kill him. We know he comes back in the sequel. Ugh, dude, I can't wait. I can't wait. I'm so excited. But, I mean, who knows how much longer we have left. I'm, I'm hoping it comes out next year. I mean, at max, I'm really, really hoping, uh, since they've been building it upon uh, Breath of the Wild's original engine and stuff like that, I'm, it could be out as by this time next year. Well, not this, probably around November. Zelda games tend to come out around November, March area. So, anyways, thank you all for watching. Hope you had a good day. Or night.